Anyway, cool. Uh, 10, 18, binary prefix divisible by 5. Given an array A of zeros and 1s, consider N sub i, the i sub array from A sub 0 to A sub i, interpret it as a binary number, uh, from most significant digit to uh, most significant bit to least significant bit. We don't list a Boolean answer where N sub i is true if and only if N sub i is divisible by 5. Okay. Hmm. You just keep on going? Okay, I mean, that seems straightforward, right? Maybe, maybe not. <laughs> okay. But you just keep on going and then left shift. Actually, in this case, it is an actual left shift. So, yeah. Uh, just doing so. Uh, and that's where we're returning. Uh, and then now we just for each bit in A. Um, okay, I guess just keep current sum. Here's zero. Where we bit we get, we left shift by one, uh, which is multiplied by two, because that's the binary digit. And then you you append whether no, and bit. And now we add it by the bit and we just check to see if it's uh, it's divisible by five. Should be okay. I heard there's a debugger now, huh? I mean, I hope I don't have to use it on Yeezy, but I, mean, I guess that would be a good time to use it if there is a ye time to use it, because I don't know. Usually I would test it more, but I guess I should actually get the habit a little bit. I think just edge cases, that maybe I don't need all the example cases. Okay, I'm going to do it anyway. <laughs> Why not? This uh, Sometimes the format is not easy to copy and paste, but this time to give it the easy to copy and paste format, so that's might as well. But some, sometimes when you have like five lines of code, you're just more confident about it. Though I said that and then I got it wrong last time, so... <laughs> sometimes you rush it, but uh, but at least on uh, on uh, a more laid-back, non-pressured situation, I don't rush as much. Um, cool, okay. I mean, I guess it could be faster. I Could it really have been that much faster? Hmm. I, mean, I guess I could have pre-allocated the results and then and not, instead of using a pen but i don't think that's that bad maybe there's some maths that you can do but i don't think i could optimize that much more uh at least in python uh somewhat so yeah this is just a very basic level math to uh handle shifts and binary numbers and so forth they even gave it to you in a way which is very uh um like a very easy to use format, so yeah. Uh, and this is pretty straightforward, I think. So I'm going to just move on. Uh, I think if if you do get this on an interview, you probably sh should consider yourself lucky. So I think that's okay. And this is just all of n, where n is the number of bits, uh, in a way. Yeah. Okay. Cool. It's a very basic problem, right? <laughs>